Hello and welcome guys and gals to Ashes Bashes Gaming, your destination for discovering new and exciting games. Today on your screens we have Flycorp. This is an uh, air traffic or air transport network management simulation by Kishmish Games which has many such uh, transport network builder games under its belt. This is scheduled for uh, release in the May of 2021. So I'm really excited to see what exactly it has in store. I mean, right now it's the demo version that they have released. So there are very limited functionalities that we can play, but they have promised a lot of things that we can play. Uh, free play is where you can, you know, continuously play, where your goal would be to unlock all countries. Challenge mode is where you can create your transport network in different parts of the world and under different conditions. Coronavirus, pandemic, hurricane or an aircraft issue, each challenge is based on a unique situation. So they have really, you know, uh, planned out and have a good roadmap for a game for what all they are going to be throwing at you. Mayors, all players see that you are the mayor and this is prestigious. Moreover, this can be a mayor in there can be a mayor in many cities at once. Okay. And if you can become a mayor in any city and if the city has already has a mayor, then overthrow him. Interesting. So they've got a lot of game modes. Challenge constructor. You've got all countries of the world and thousands of cities to create your own challenge. Lots of things to do. So I'm going to play what they have in hand and then we can uh, you know think about what the full version might have so in this mode we need to unlock a new country every six minutes okay then so basically there are different cities and we have to build air uh, routes to all of them okay right now we don't have 156 uh, dollars maybe million dollars i don't know could be billion too i don't know what exactly it is that we are opening here it's just like a route i'm going to fast forward the game they have that option given to us so that i reach 156 quickly and you know what while we are at it if i click on each plane i can upgrade it one more level and i can see uh, how what's its capacity like there are seven out of 20 people and i know from being the son of a person of a some of someone who is working with the airlines that that's a very loss making situation like see this this is going for zero bucks i mean i don't know how this makes any sense we can sell it for half the price uh and technically so when we are opening a route we are technically buying a plane technically so this has got to be in billions and not even millions and when we click on it we can see uh, how long it is what's its speed Stuttgart to Berlin it's taking 13 people that's good and when it becomes as you can see it's yellow so that means it's uh, nearly full if it's red that means it's completely full and if not on the plane if we just click on the route then we can buy a new plane for the route sell the route and these are the two options basically and if you click on any one of the cities then uh, you can upgrade the city uh, the airport level basically what happens is when since i have not uh, connected hamburg and stuttgart people will be going from hamburg to stuttgart via hanover and berlin and plus wh whoever there are new people of berlin who are at the airport and want to travel so basically, if there are too many people in the airport, the airport gets filled. So the airport also needs to be upgrade, upgraded to have more capacity. So basically, if flights can be upgraded for more capacity, airports can be upgraded for more capacity and uh, routes can have more than one flights functioning on it. So basically, I really think this, the game developers may be may have some soft corner in their heart for germany okay so this is an event that's happened olympic games are being held in germany number of passengers willing to fly there is three times larger for a week okay so as you can see everything is gone up you can open a new route here and our goal is to open the route to switzerland where is switzerland 
Sweden, Poland. Okay, I must. Apologies for my uh, geography. Where is Switzerland? Okay, Switzerland is down here. So we can open Switzerland by 300 uh, billion. Basically, I think we are buying out the officials of that place. And uh, I mean, I don't know whether that's legal or not. But as I was saying, I think the people have a soft corner for this spot because they are always uh, the developers have a soft corner for this for Germany because every game starts from Germany. I don't know why. Now we can open a country up before time, but I don't really see the point of that. So there is no incentive to open off a country before time. And I think that is actually a drawback of the game. Probably it should not be country traffic increased for four and a half minutes more. Okay. And we are still at uh, fine capacity. None of, okay. One plane is reached red. It's nearly full actually. It's not completely full. So I'm not, okay. That's because there is a connecting flight here. So you know what, since this is anyway a double route, I will buy a new plane. Two planes operating at capacity here though it does make sense to buy a plane after you unlock the first level of any plane because then the cost goes up marginal utility basically uh, that makes sense since uh, let's say every level would give me one more around from 20 it would the capacity would go to 50 and that's not really necessary right now so it will become, see, we've got one plane again going at 17 capacity, whereas this dude goes at zero capacity. So that should tell you something. So probably I'm, I hope I can open up Stuttgart more now since we can open up Switzerland soon. 300 and we've got just 45 seconds. I can't afford to open anything else. The 100 spent there actually uh, made me weaker. This was an unnecessary flight that we've opened here. It's consistently going for zero and i think i might as well you know just let's hold on to that sunk cost slightly more probably it will pay off over time now, as you noticed i waited till the last moment to open that uh new country up because that way i get more time to play the game i need to pull one and i need root here and i need 79 for it uh you know what let's speed up we get 79 okay so i can't pause and view the map every time i pause the map would stop let's open this first okay stuttgart is just definitely becoming a prime location now so i'm glad that new plane additional plane is at stuttgart stuttgart sorry let's speed it up till 60 whatever I don't know why I keep pressing the pause button. 61. Well, let's open this. And now since Stuttgart has become a hub, we need to very quickly upgrade this uh, airport. You know what? Let's go at double speed. Okay. Let's upgrade. Berlin is almost full. Really? How are there that many people at Berlin? Unexpected. So as we are in a good spot right now, Okay, these dudes are red, but that's fine. I think maybe we might need to upgrade these planes now. But the interesting fact about this game, which I really liked is it has consistent music at the back too, which sounds really good and, you know, keeps you uh, upbeat. So every time we upgrade a plane, you see the size also becomes bigger. So probably this is now a Boeing plane and I think we might need to upgrade Berlin before long. Well, it is the capital city after all. Let's do it. Hopefully we shall not face further complications because of that. Okay, flights at this end are actually going a little slow. This flight is somehow going red. This is the second time I've noticed Berlin Hanover being red. So this is still a week, mind you. Okay, they are always at 20 capacity, so I should definitely definitely upgrade them. So I'm not very happy about my money situation right now.
133 okay well now the money situation is good we have to open up austria austria is here so munich would be getting uh, another connecting point austria would take 321 okay so the cost for opening every successive uh, country goes up government of germany gave you a grant for upgrading an airport in berlin level of this airport has been increased let's see it was previously 100 it's now gone to 300 that's amazing but Dusseldorf is now opened where should we send people you know what let's open both routes to frankfurt as well as Dusseldorf. one thing i've noticed in this game people are always willing to fly so there is no problem that way though i would say that would actually reduce the uh actual management of the game like i don't know how many people from bern want to go to berlin to hamburg and you know if that data point was there that would have actually made things worth uh you know really put an effort on my brain capacity because right now it is more of just open up the areas open up some uh upgrade some things it's a very simple game but i think they have made it that way since they intend to open uh, since they intend to release this game on uh, mobile also probably that's why they have kept it simple so i do appreciate simple games this game does have a uh, you know potential for something much much greater i can open austria but i am going to hold that money right now and see where the situation might be going bad well this dude is back to red but the other plane is hardly having anybody so i am not going to upgrade he's full let's see what this plane coming back has still has seven people so there's no use of upgrading this plane right now Stuttgart has 100 and i think it's doing fine so basically you have to keep a watch as on your planes on your routes and on your airports now how you are the only people i mean how you are the only player in this situation is beyond me I mean, it would be interesting to have a another player also operating its airline two or three would be interesting two or three airlines so this does really make you think you know uh, what if these kind of uh, spoke hub airport uh, or airway divisions or planning would make out would they actually make more sense and i think if this game was made slightly more detailed it would be a good simulation for aspiring uh, management uh, people who would be playing or who would be working in the airways aspiring people aspiring managers in the airline sector let's open this route too i hope we have something here zero people going to vienna imagine that oh there's a new airport opened here too let's anyway send it to stuttgart since stuttgart is upgraded Wow, this flight to Vienna is actually going for a loss. How about this? We are making good losses from Vienna. The people of Austria are not interested in Berlin. And I am not inclined to open up Switzerland to Austria, Austria right now. Let's keep it going at this way. Because hardly look at these i mean it's it's bad okay berlin finally has decent number of people we need to upgrade stuttgart i think we're putting too much pressure on stuttgart probably but it's become kind of a hub next thing is france so beru will be beru and snarbacken might be getting a lot of traffic now hopefully hopefully to munich we've noticed one red from stuttgart to munich let's see if that happens again 
if it does uh, one red from frankfurt to dusseldorf no it's not happened again i think we are safe we don't need to upgrade anything as of now oh no frankfurt to dusseldorf needs to be upgraded the second time that i am noticing red there so i think that's how you should play the game my humble opinion the music does keep you company it's like you know if you are going on a long drive and something is playing on the background while you are not doing active work but you do need to pay attention and there's something good entertaining playing at the background and over to hamburg is going red interesting maybe it's just this one instance or maybe it's regular we need to keep a watch okay dusseldorf needs to be upgraded here we are very good in terms of money france will just take 343 to open up so i would rather not there's a contest for the best airline participating will cost us 306 well you know what let's go for it newemberg is now open well stuttgart is getting a lot of footfall now 300 300 is very high let's just leave this as it is so berlin stuttgart is getting a decent amount of footfall and i like that you can zoom in so much unfortunately we didn't win well that's that's cheating dude 300 uh, billion lost to nothing okay i should not take such risks again so these two flights are not really very helpful probably i should have just upgraded that one flight so that's fine no issues they're doing very well right now you know what let's speed in things up stuttgart to frankfurt went red no more red now that's fine first flight is always red okay the second flight is actually overtaking it so i think they have uh, made it such that uh, full flights travel slower maybe i don't know let's open snarbucken and upgrade snarbucken actually you know i am expecting more people to move to uh parry the great parry okay was this the second flight that's red wait you know let's slow down things a bit okay i am noticing red flights now 50 you know what why don't we upgrade you probably things will be better now let's see stuttgart to frankfurt starbucken to paris is also going red let's upgrade that first and this too and this we definitely no it's enough it's still uh, orange so i don't think we need to worry about it so one flight from berlin always goes red Oh wow there are a lot of people going in this direction Okay Munich uh is going red So I would might as well upgrade these dudes Wow imagine that this I think I should buy a new plane Okay so again let's speed in things up Star button probably needs no doesn't let's upgrade this It's one of our biggest planes right now I think. Let's uh air show a few days our PR departments Specialist recommend us 
participate well you know if the air show why not new airport has opened in lily let's open one to paris and one to dusseldorf hopefully that should not be too much of a problem look at this this dude is always going red so let's buy a new plane and probably upgrade the second plane once Let's see anybody else. Airshow was good. Other companies performed better. Our analysts didn't notice any changes in demand for our tickets. Well, that's two sets of monies spent uselessly. I don't know. Let's look, keep be on the lookout for red. Okay, this dude is red. This okay, both of them are red. Imagine that. Look at imagine the number of people who want to go to Paris. Paris is a interesting hub i i must say everybody is interested in going there this is red let's see if it happens again dusseldorf needs to be upgraded but not many people traveling back from paris huh interesting so the people going to paris are preferring to stay there probably let's upgrade this once lily lily i've never heard of this town before I think we should I mean money flowing in the rate of it is gone up exponentially. They doing pretty pretty well. I don't spot any reds. That means no uh profits lost. Lily needs to be upgraded. Okay. I think Li Lily is taking quite a bit load off Parry. Uh, I should have actually added a new plane that would have been better. I mean less expensive considering our time is a little less. Oh Vienna to Berlin is finally red. Czech Republic. Czech Republic is here. Vienna will have more people. 368. Hopefully we can get it quickly. I'm not going to spend anything anywhere else for the time being. Yes, opened up Prague. Where all do we open Prague up to? Nuremberg 190. You know what? Let's open pa Prague to Vienna first. And then probably to Berlin and Nuremberg. Makes sense. I think I'm investing too much in Prague. Vienna to Berlin, I mean people going from, I mean if the people who want to go from Vienna to Berlin don't get a seat on the direct flight, they might want to go via Prague, that would be good. There's a new airport, oh Marcel, let's connect Marcel, I don't think the traffic will be so much. We may need to increase this dude. Since it's got Marcel coming in now. Okay, this definitely needs to be upgraded. Oh, we're running a little low on monies. That's fine. Hanover and Frankfurt are taking quite a bit of footfall. So, I mean, this game is definitely not too technical. I would recommend it for kids. I mean, to give a child something where, you know, he can soar across the uh, skies and have a bird's eye view of how an airplane company operates. I think that's pretty good uh, an experience for children. It does open their and broadens their horizons so that they understand actually how our air networks actually work. I don't see anywhere else and that I need to invest in. Everything is green as of now. No problems uh, noted yet. We are stocking up on some money right now. So Parry and Snarbuck and let's see how are these flights performing. Okay, they've gone down. The footfall has gone down significantly. This is too significant a drop in the footfall. 
I mean, I didn't expect it to go down so badly. Five people, zero people. You know what? Let's sell this plane. Doesn't make sense. We need to open up Sweden next. Sweden is here. Okay. Got still quite a bit of time for it. No issues. I wonder what happened to all the traffic between Perry and Snarbuckan. Somehow it has all gone to the dogs. Everything's green, so you know what? Let's speed in things up. Till we spot something to do. Frankfurt is almost full. Where is Frankfurt? Okay. You know, since you are getting full. Serious problem with the baggage at Nuremberg. A lot of items were lost. Passengers are going to file a class action. Should we hire lawyers? Well, I mean, it's not that we don't have we have any other option right now. Uh, sell plane? No. Add a new plane, please. Nice, nice. New airport has opened in Nice, and we are adding this route to Lyon. Probably we should upgrade Lyon now. Let's see, is there anything else to do? Hell that we have to pay 280 to passengers as a compensation. What was the point of getting those lawyers then? Those dudes did nothing. Okay, this flight is going full. Let's upgrade it. Anything else going red? Well, this dude is. Let's upgrade it. And let's fast forward things a bit burn where is burn burn is here right so let's upgrade no issues i appreciate the, f the notification prague hanover i see a lot of yellows no red yet one minute left okay i think we're doing pretty uh, decently for what this demo has to offer it's not that complicated and if i can do it in one sitting well any kid can too if you're raining in a lot of minutes sweden oh well that was the end of the demo boys that's what they had to offer completed without saving why would anybody save this okay, i'm number five for all that means for whatever it does so boys uh, that's what this game is all about and uh, developers oh so we can see. this is a a very good interesting looking feature i am actually interested to see what this game has to offer on release i think it would be interesting uh, for mostly for young adults and children to experience this game and try out things like what we played right now was the demo version so there was a lot of limited functionality about it but uh, the full version is definitely going to have much much more to it so I, the link to their steam page is down in the description below if you want to check it out and uh, if you enjoyed this video then smash that like button and consider subscribing to my channel so that you can discover new and exciting games this is ashes Ashes signing off until next video Game on!